Just to remind you, it's the first to 18 over the two days. When the next bond is potted red, black, red, given away four on a foul, and now back at the table. Very much wanted to thread the cue ball round behind the back of the black, but I don't think he can now pot it. The cue ball has run on too far. Beans, of course, the cushion. He potted the blue, and rather hope really that he'd missed the contact with the yellow. Because he was near the cushion, couldn't widen the angle off the blue. Six. Well, that was a good attempt. Not often Stephen uh, plays clever safeties like that. Striking the cushion a fraction before the red was struck to make the necessary angle. Looks like a weak reply from Bond. Well short of the ball climb. He'll be hoping that Hendry's queuing is sufficiently hampered to make a difference. Sufficiently hampered for Hendry to select another shot. Kiss on the yellow helped Nigel there. Last couple of safety shots just had to trust a little bit to luck. You can't keep depending on that. Foul four and the mid. That contact had nice to be one. very thin so that the cue ball didn't go into the corner pocket or the jaws of it. Well, I'd suggest if Nigel can't get through to this red near the left corner, he should have it replaced. Stephen Hendry can get through to this red in the left corner. I was right and he was wrong. hoping that uh, Hendry is snookered on the black or snookered on its potting angle at least looks like it well, after such a good pot on the red that is really unlucky unlucky for Nigel as well He can't get the cue ball away. Well, 
it turned out that he One could. It didn't appear that he could hit the black half ball that side, but he managed to get to that angle and stun it down the table. Another terrific pot from One. Stephen Hendry. And this time he's plum on the colour. Good chance for Stephen Hendry, and 14. everybody's talking at the moment. Is he the best player ever? And, and all the accolades that have been given him. I'll certainly say one thing, Clive. He's the cleanest potter I've ever seen for actually hitting the ball clean in the pocket without touching the side. Twenty-one. Yes, I agree with that, John, and also proof of the man is what he's won. 22. In an era of maximum competitiveness. 28. More good players about than ever before. 28. Not happy with that positional play though. But this is the man. Even when he gets awkward, you don't really expect him to miss an easy shot. There you go. Difficult shot. Using the spider, he only just slipped the edge. You want a nitpick? Thirty-five.
forth and speak. Forty-three. Well, pretty straight. He's going to have to force this off the jaw this time to get position on the red. Well, decided to roll it in and play for the more difficult one. But there 49. you see it. So just the red and the colour. And Nigel Bond will need a snooker. Makes it look so easy. Bad safety shot. Stephen Henry should have been playing the safety shot he played. I won't be glib enough to say, Clive, that if he had it done, these could have been his. Henry has made them with an air of total certainty. He's taken his game up a gear. 53. Three, Stephen Hendry and the break. And Stephen Hendry's fourth consecutive break of 60 or more in four frames takes him three ahead at 8-5.